many Christians, they think that the God of Islam is as similar as the God of the Christians. So we imply right away our understanding and view of our God on the God of the Muslims. You need to take a note that the God of Islam have nothing to do with our God. He is not even a spirit. Our God is a spirit. So the nature of God in Islam is different from our, the nature of our God. And let us see what the Muslims say about themselves before you imply your own belief on someone else. This is what many Christians they do usually. As an example, when we say the word genie, right away, right away you will see a Christian or even a Christian priest, he say to you, oh demon. But Islam does not believe in demon, they believe in genie. Genie is not a demon. Genie is not a spirit. Demon is a spirit. So, please, please Christians, listen carefully and correct yourself. Now, this is the official uh, uh, government website. Uh, 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 I think it's uh, sponsored by uh, Qatar uh, the Prince of Qatar who sponsored Al-Qaeda uh, and the question is a Christian is asking a Muslim is Allah a spirit or do Allah have a spirit as you see the question in front of you the answer is very simple no the spirit or a soul is not one of the attribute of Allah rather it is one of his things of the things that he have uh, or have been created by Allah so please Christians don't think of your God the same way as the God of Muslims your God is a spirit he is a spirit not only like, like when somebody he has a spirit he is spirit this is why we say the Holy Spirit so our God is a spirit the God of Islam is not yeah. now what that means? It's perfectly 